I'm Richard Mayer, CEO of Real Spirit USA. Today we're going to talk about alkaline water versus bottled water. I have a story about that. We were at a show one time and we were selling water ionizers and other things and people would walk by with bottled water and I'd say to them, you know, you're drinking Coke. And I go, what do you mean I'm drinking Coke? And they were very nice and I said, let me have your bottle. And I pour it in a little tiny container, put two drops of reagent into it and all of a sudden it comes up 4.5 pH. And they go, well, what's pH? Well, pH is potential hydrogen. Okay, the higher the pH, 7.0 is literally called neutral, which is most water is about 7.0. Your city water is 7.0, your well water is varies whatever the minerals are in it. So if you're below 7.0, it is really not healthy for you, but you're drinking the water. Now the water's clean, the water has no properties to hurt you. If there's a thing called heterotropic, which is a bacteria count, it has a very low heterotropic count, but is it good for you? No, because it doesn't give you the benefits of alkaline water. Alkaline water is a natural occurring state with a water ionizer. Can you buy alkaline water in bottled water? Sure you can. But what they do, they add chemicals to it, which makes it an alkaline water. You can put baking soda in water and it'll make it alkaline, but you don't want to drink that stuff. So a water ionizer is a natural way to make alkaline water. So again, 7.0 is but neutral, and then above 7.0 pH, it becomes alkaline, below 7.0 becomes acidic. So what a water ionizer does, it takes an anode and a cathode, easy, positive and negative plates, pass the water through, the alkaline water goes up, the acid water goes down, we split it, and then you come out with two streams of water. And that's what a water ionizer does, and it's natural, it absolutely has no chemicals whatsoever, so you're really getting the water, but it's just changing the properties or the molecular structure of the water to make it alkaline and acidic.